this is Dr. Abdul Rahman Hakim. I'm a consultant uh, transplant surgeon at Dr. Rela Institute and Medical Center. There are three common ways of pancreas transplant. One is uh, implanting a pancreas along with a kidney transplant, which is called as a simultaneous pancreas and kidney transplant. Uh, the second thing is basically somebody who's already had a kidney transplant and we uh, implant pancreas in them. And the third one is where uh, we transplant pancreas along. Let me just give you a sort of understanding of uh, these three uh, types of pancreas uh, transplant. Um, now, I think, I mean, for the, for the simultaneous pancreas and kidney transplant, which is where we uh, transplant both the pancreas and the kidney, um, this happens in about uh, two thirds of the patients, we do both the transplants. So one of the main indications for pancreas and kidney transplant is patients uh, who have got diabetes and uh, have had progressive damage to their kidneys and either have already started on dialysis or, or uh, nearing dialysis. Um, so for these patients what we do is that we, uh, we make a cut in the center of the tummy um, and, and we implant the pancreas first uh, which is uh, behind the right bowel and then the kidney uh, gets transplanted through the same incision into the left side of the tummy. So this basically gives them relief both from the diabetes and also from the kidney failure. And this is basically the commonest uh, reason for a pancreas transplant. The second thing is uh, where we do a pancreas after a kidney transplant. Um, this is for those, for example, somebody has already had a kidney transplant um, because of the kidney failure and they're diabetic and they want uh, an utmost sort of full control of their blood sugar so that their new kidney does not get damaged with, with the diabetes then we do a pancreas transplant after them. So it's basically pancreas after a kidney transplant. Third one and the most uncommon one is where uh, somebody gets a pancreas transplant alone. For example, somebody has got very erratic uh, blood sugar control um, and, and, and get problems because of uh, either hypoglycemia where the, the blood sugar is very low and, and they are not aware of it and these people can neither get a fit or they can get a very sort of uh, accidental injury because of sudden fall from low blood, blood sugar or they get very high blood sugar. For these patients, we can do a pancreas transplant alone. But however, this is not a very common uh, reason for uh, a pancreas transplant.